Happy Tuesday, everyone. Thank you for watching Atlanta and Company. I'm Kara Kinnear. If you're still pondering what to do in your free time, why not head out to the 50th annual steeplechase? From fun hats to great food and, of course, horse racing, it's one of the best events in Georgia. And here to tell us more in our frugal kitchen is Sean O'Keefe. Good morning. Good morning. How yes. are you? How yes. nice to oh see you. Oh my gosh, so good to see you. Thank you How so nice much for coming. You. And it's Chef Derek, but we'll get to him in a minute. It's well, a he's, yes. he's a very important part. He is. Milton's he is. Cuisine and Cocktails uh -huh. is doing all of the food and signature beverages for the Atlanta Homes and Lifestyles Chairman's okay. End this year. So it's going to be really exciting. Yeah. And the things that are most important to me about the steeplechase, delicious food, which mm -hmm. we'll see in a second, okay. Okay. a nice signature cocktail, and fashionable hats for the ladies and bow ties for the boys. Can we be best friends? We can be best friends. Okay, I'm we can so be excited. Best friends. Okay. So for me, like, I go to 310 Rosemont all the time. They've okay. got uh, hundreds of bow ties there, and they're always nice and colorful, and just a little pop of color for yeah, the men. you always look so dapper. Okay, thank you. You do. I pay you a lot to say that. No, we're um, best friends now, so but I But But y'all ladies get to choose all these fanciful hats, and my friend Sue Moorhead, who owns Sue's Seams, okay. custom millinery, it's a very difficult word for I me to say, um, sits down with all our clients and she does everything from source out the straw to build the hats to all the fun little adornments. And she really can create anything for anyone for any event. Shan, these are works of art. I don't know if the camera can get it, but they are absolutely beautiful. You can tell that the artistry and the handwork that goes into this. I, I love this one. It looks it almost looks like an old time swim hat. It's beautiful. Which reminds me of my grandma, which reminds me of those like beautiful women that you see that would just, you know, have like a mm -hmm. profile with this stunning hat on. I just I, I love beautiful. Them because what she does is she finds little adornments and little bits of fabric and things like that that she will use to help accent the hat. Okay. And this matching my it's sort of what I'll do. Well, why not? I don't get to wear them on Saturday, but I can wear them on the show today. You can wear them on Saturday. Let's have a cocktail. <laughs> Let's do it. Okay, so Milton's is doing for us okay. a peach, Georgia peach basil mojito, which is fresh peach juice, okay. which we've cleverly hidden in this other bottle. <laughs> and then it's a little bit of shellback rum. Okay. I'm just going to put, give us a light, a, lot. a light cocktail for okay. the morning. Fine, John. Uh, this one can be yours. It's a little not as light as mine. <laughs> and then some fresh lime juice. Okay, perfect. It looks beautiful. We're just going to stir, stir it up. up. Okay. And then we're going to spank our herbs this morning to help release the flavor. See, that's why I want to be his best that friend. That we have. So what this does is okay. it just allows the herb and the oils in the herb to become a little more forced out okay. of the basil. And then it'll help to season the cocktail a little more. So okay. just get one spank, drop one it in spank. your drink. Give it a little stir, okay. and I'm going to finish with a couple of little slices of lime. And this wow. should be delicious. Wait a second. Okay. Let's have a little club soda. Okay, okay, Just sure. make it a little bit lighter. It's beautiful. I've been saying beautiful a lot in this segment, but all of these things are so amazing. Thank well, you. Well, it's, it's, it's really fun to have all the pieces of the steeplechase all combined together. Cheers. To your health. Thank you for coming. And to our next part, the crab cake. Oh, my gosh. Hi, Chef Derek. Hi. Chef Derek. So one of the food items that we have here that we're going to do is we're going to do a lump crab cake. It's a Maryland-style crab cake, but we put a little southern twist on it with uh, some cracked mustard coleslaw. So I've got uh, mostly, mostly crab, very little breadcrumbs, a little bit of flavored mayonnaise, oh. um, some fresh slider buns right here. Wow. So we have this right here. And I also have a little bit of cracked mustard coleslaw. I use Savoy cabbage, carrots, and some red onion. And the mix is uh, uh, flavored mayonnaise again. A um, little cider vinegar and cracked mustard. Okay. We're so excited to have Milton's involved with the steeplechase this year. Um, the Atlanta Homes and Lifestyles Chairman's Tent has been uh, a huge part of the history of the 50th year okay. of the steeplechase. And this year we've partnered with Milton's to create a southern style menu that will evolve throughout the day, starting at 11 o'clock with light appetizers, through an early lunch, a middle lunch, a late lunch, and then a giant dessert buffet to look after our approximately 440 guests inside the chairman's wow. tent. It's the biggest it's ever been. Wow, Milton's, a staple at the steeplechase with a crab cake. And it's yeah. kind of cool. And what they've done is they've tried to bring a little bit of what they do at the restaurant into the steeplechase for us this year. Milton's is very famous for its farm dinners where they right. set up these beautiful long tables actually in the farm behind the restaurant. So we've been able to sort of capitalize on that, source out some other really great local produce, and then sort of put it all together with a nice little signature cocktail to make it sort of a fun 
and great environment for the and whole day. And that feels so southern to me because it's about family and community and sitting I at agree. the long tables and having a big party and eating crab cakes, which it doesn't get much better than that, and a good cocktail. It's going to be a what really exciting wrong? thing. And my favorite thing ever, the Budweiser Clydesdales are going to be there. And that sort of, for me, that just makes me feel like a kid and happy and right. all that stuff. Right, okay, so as, I'm, I'm new here, so where do I go to go to the, where do I go? To it's in the, Rome, Georgia. Okay, in Rome, so it's Georgia. about uh, an hour and a half outside of Atlanta. Okay. There are still tickets available for the infield and other parts of the steeplechase. It is a huge Atlanta tradition. And I really think that we should try to get as many people out there yes. to see it again. It's part of the National Steeplechase Organization. It's one of only a few steeplechases that happen in the entire country and we expect anywhere between 24 and 26,000 people and it's supposed to rain That's so bring amazing. your rubbers well <laughs> well and <laughs> i mean your rubbers and your hats okay rubbers so, and hats okay people and you we can where else do you get to wear these clothes and be like My the camaraderie. House, typically, any Friday or Saturday. That's why we're gonna be. That's why we're gonna be best friends. Can we're I gonna sell you a crab yes, cake? we're gonna enjoy these crab cakes and drink our cocktails as we go into the break. To contact Sean, give him a call at 404-228-7903 or email at info at seanokeefeevents.com. Like him on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash Sean O'Keefe Events. We're so happy that you were here. Thank you, darling. I appreciate it. Up next, we're laughing with and at radio personality Jeff Dollar. Details are next. Cheers, my friends. Yay! Hey.